Right, I've got an inverter here that I've got outside of a, uh, a little scanner. The, uh, and uh, basically I've hooked up two wires to the output. Uh, the input's 5 volts and the output is about 100 volts. Now uh, I've got some little connectors here and I've got a little project box. Now what I'm thinking is that will fit quite nicely inside that project box with the connectors in. Uh, we can have a switch on it. So we've got the uh, input and output. So uh, I'm going to connect the uh, connectors up now. I'll go and do that. Right, I've uh, drilled all the holes for the connectors. And I'm just going to uh, place them in there. And see how much space we got left for the actual board. So I'm going to do that now. We've got the uh, 5 volt connectors in place and the yellow high voltage in place. We just need to uh, place the board in and solder it in, which I'll do now. Right, we've uh, soldered up the uh, low voltage side now. So we just need to uh, cut these down and solder them up and then uh, put the top on the box. I think I remembered just as I was soldering up that side is the fact that uh, we want to be able to switch it on and off. So I've got a switch here which I've put in between the, uh, the red wire and a little caution sticker saying that the, uh, there's going to be high voltage coming out. So uh, we just need to uh, hook up these two sides now, and this should be done then. Now we've uh, hooked up the extra two leads, and we've got the finished product. All we need to do is put the top on and test it, so I'll do that now. So we've got the uh, finished product now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use my uh, solar charger to power it up and my multimeter to see uh, what kind of voltage we're getting out either side. I'll do that now. Right, I've got my uh, solar charger here that I've upgraded now to have uh, two batteries in it. So it's, uh, it's at 8 volts and then uh, we're regulating that back down to 5 volts. I think it works out at uh, 5.1 volt. And that's coming round and into this little box here. And then uh, the outputs are going to the AC of this meter here. Now, if I was to switch this little box on, you can see that uh, we're getting 108.5 volts AC out of there. And you can see that the, uh, the neon's on inside the switch, which is brilliant. So uh, that's great then. Uh, we've managed to get like a, a five, five volt DC. Stepped up all the way to 108.5 volts. Thanks for watching. Interesting thought at the end. Uh, we've got a solar panel hooked up to uh, this little inverter. The uh, neon's lit there. We come round and uh, you can see that it's uh, fully lit there. So uh, you can see it's, uh, it, it, it's working as it should, which is brilliant. Thanks for watching.